Tuesday, January 13th, 2015, um, at the barber shop trying to start my day off for the first uh, set it off uh, video blog that I'm going to be doing. Um, just got here, set the appointment for 10 o'clock. I'm a little bit late, so uh, Jermaine is kind of mad at me right now. Yeah, I'm saying, yeah, I'm saying. <laughs> So uh, I gotta hop in this chair. I got a lot of stuff to do today, but I'm gonna take y'all along with me. Scott, we finna get it in, son. We finna, yeah. I'm finna make you look righteous, even though I look a hot mess myself. <laughs> but you know, I specialize in other people, not myself. Yeah, man. Other people. It's all right, man. Yeah. You look like he just been making pizzas, needing flour. <laughs> <laughs> got it. This hurts. Alright, I've been sitting here for like 15 minutes trying to figure out if I like this or not. Jermaine. Pondering, thinking. So, uh, it's something new, something I haven't done before. So uh, tell me what you think in the comments down below. You know, you like this 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 cut or should I just let it grow back and do something different? But uh, Jermaine, it's his work. So it's his fault whether you like it or not. <laughs> Alright, I got to get out of here and get to work. Alright, so we finally made it over to the home of Beacon Light. Um, he's going to be helping me out with the, with shooting some photos down in his basement. Um, he's actually got a pretty sweet setup down here. He's a mostly, he's a very, very talented guy. Um, and we're still waiting for Stephen Malcolm to get here, but this is going to be one of the most interesting photo shoots that I've ever done. Um, I've never had props and stuff like this. I really can't, I'm trying not to tell you exactly what uh what's going on here but you know kind of got the little makeshift setup down here but it still works out and did some really really good images so uh all i'm gonna say is we're about to set it off so uh one thing that i'm really really excited about doing for this uh for this particular photo shoot is something i've always wanted to have in a video or a photo shoot or something is one of these bad boys it's a molotov cocktail so beacon we're gonna go outside we're gonna light this thing light it Light it up. Oh, so you got to get the match of the, the lighter thing. Oh my goodness. We got to light Fire. it up. Have you ever, only the the most in your face tough guys light their Molotov cocktails with these long <laughs> lady lighters. So we actually can't light it and like explode it. We have to, man, I don't have no, no, no shoes on. I got to borrow your shoes real quick. Yeah, Beacon wears like a size 72 shoe. Size 72. Gosh. What is it, a 13 for real? You look like a duck. I know. I wear 11, he wears a 13. My feet don't fit. All right, so uh, here it is. You Lighting, want? ready? Let's do this. All right. Watch the cops come down the road and like, we get in trouble for this. All right, I think. Put it out, George. You ah! don't want to, ignore... oh, ah! no. No. <laughs> Before it gets to the gasoline, bro. Yeah, we can't. we blow up. Okay, luckily it's snowing. All right. We're good. We didn't blow anything up. Don't try this at home. And by the way, this is not gasoline in there. That's just, that's just water. We're not that stupid. Uh, <laughs> My man, Steve and Malcolm just pulled up. So things can really get started. We're gonna start this photo shoot off now. You done brought the pizza and everything? Oh, you know how we do it, bro. I ain't a breakfast or lunch. This breakfast and lunch. <laughs> Feel me? Five dollars. All right, finally, now that uh, Steven has got through eating his pizza, changed his wardrobe, we are finally ready to go in here and do this, this shoot. Uh, let's see where everybody's at right now. Uh, Steven's got the, got the Molotov cocktail. What it do? It's good. So, I'm not going to drink it. <laughs> This is gonna be an interesting side. I'm, I'm debating on how this is gonna be. Like I can't even, it's, it's hard to tell them like what this, what's going on. Should I tell them what's going on or should I make them wait to see what's going on after we get all this through? I would make them wait, yeah. Make them, they not ready? They not ready. Yeah, cause this is gonna come way out. This is gonna come out before. Uh, I'm gonna finish this up today. Try to get it up on YouTube by at least tonight or tomorrow. And then you guys will just have to stay tuned to see what we doing with, uh, with the Molotov cocktail, the photo shoot. Um, in the song that's going to be coming out, but you'll get a little sneak preview of, of, of the music. You ain't ready. No, nah, they not ready. <laughs> hey, yo, Mookie, say that. Come over here and smash his house, bro. That's what I'm talking about. I like that. I just want to part of your head.
All right, that was a fun photo shoot. We got to spend some time posing and, you know, modeling and all of that, which we are very good at, mind you. Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> it's so weird doing photo shoots every time I do them, but this right here holds all the images that we took. So I'm about to slide this into my computer and uh, see what comes up. Nothing. <laughs> Blank file. We gotta start all over. Oh, uh, yo, what's good? It's your boy Stephen Malcolm. The song's gonna be hot. The song is exciting. It is adrenaline pumping. Uh, can't wait for these uh, short films and these pictures to hit the streets. Yeah, you know I mean, uh, the message is gonna be sick. You feel me? My boy George Moss killed it. You feel me? I killed it, you feel me? So uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? We uh, we finna turn up, turn up. We finna set it off in this piece, you know what I mean? That sounds so convincing in the kitchen that is designed by Beacon's wife. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's all pretty in here and you, you know, but it's all good. That's I'm really excited about the song. I'm really excited about the message behind the song and I know that uh, there's a lot of people that won't get it, uh, but I'm excited more so about creating the conversation and, uh, and seeing what what that leads to so it's not something i actually wanted to do at the beginning of it i prayed about this a lot before i decided to to do something like this and you guys will understand what i'm talking about when it finally comes out but um just continue to be in prayer uh, about the song about the message and that uh um that the intention would be heard behind the music all right y'all peace